Hey there, welcome back. Now I know everybody is eagerly awaiting my thoughts on Final Fantasy VII Rebirth and my full review of the game, but I haven't had a lot of time and I'm getting ready to travel and I'm going to be gone for a little bit here, so I will have played a lot more of it by the time this video comes out, but I didn't want to put up like a halfway. The next video you see on Rebirth is going to be my full review on it, my thoughts after I've beaten the game. Um, so today I want to talk about a little game that I was playing with my daughter called Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Heroes in the Hot Shell Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Shredder's Revenge So this game was released a while ago. This came out back in like November of 2022 and it's a fun game. I never really played it at the time and I was kind of scrolling through PSN and I, I have PS Plus so I have some games included and I noticed this was free on there. So my daughter is a huge fan of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. So I, I figured, you know, let's try it. And it was actually a lot of fun. So I was looking for a game that the two of us could play together. And this was right at this sweet spot where it's hard enough that I could get some enjoyment out of it. And it was easy enough that she could play too. So we played through the whole game together up until the very last level where the last level actually has like a pretty difficult boss fight and when you're playing with somebody who's not totally good with the game it's kind of hard so me and chase were playing through we were playing with brooke and she was doing this thing where she was just standing up in the one corner of the map and she's like yeah you guys handle it and it's like you know we we can't do enough damage and we died and died and died but it is so much fun and if you have like a little kid who's interested in Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles or you're gonna have a friend over or something this game is awesome I mean each of the levels are, are super cool they have like different little twists that they throw in all the time there's there's different combos that you can do to kind of like throw an enemy at the screen or I didn't really switch between the turtles that much because she really wanted me to play as the blue guy it, what's the blue turtles name let's take a look here Okay, so Leonardo. That's who she had me playing as. The whole time was Leonardo, and she wanted to play as Michelangelo the whole time. So that's what we did for the most part. We did have a couple times where we had, like, my dad playing and Ashley would play with, or, or Chase was playing. So we had, like, three or four players, sometimes just two. But it was awesome. Like, from beginning to end, I really enjoyed it. It's not a very long game. Let me take a look over on how long to beat. Okay, so right here it says the main story takes about like three to four hours, and if you want to do everything in the game, it'll take you like 20 and a half hours. So not super long, but it was really good. I really liked it, and if you're interested, you should definitely go check it out. It's a fun game. It's free over on PlayStation Plus, and, and I thoroughly enjoyed it. You know, this is exactly what I was looking for. This was a fun family game, and we're probably going to play through it more, and just... I could totally see this being a game that we keep coming back to. I mean, she was totally infatuated with this game the whole way through and it's fun because every level is different you know you join in and it's like okay this is the level you're gonna ride a hoverboard for the first half now now you're chasing the truck down the street or it's always got something to keep you interested from level to level and i i thought it was a lot of fun you know what it reminded me a lot of metal slug i remember playing metal slug over at the bowling alley and this reminded me of that so much just a simple little easy arcadey beat him up it was so much fun i i really like this game you should definitely go check it out let me know what you think down in the comments section below have you played this game before do you think it's fun and more importantly what other games can you recommend to me that i could play with my daughter because now that we beat this she's really looking for something else this was so much fun what a great family game until next time i'll see you later goodbye this video is brought to you by your support on patreon Visit patreon.com slash 94 to help support the channel. Get it!